to design today we're going to look at the uh, digital business card the second section of our digital business card and we're going to be creating it on Canva so you need the Canva software either on your phone or on your computer so our channel is dedicated in bringing you uh, great designs for your business as an entrepreneur content creator in such a way that you're able to manage your budget so we are a DIY digital marketing channel if you like our content please consider subscribing and thank you for joining us for the tutorial today so once you landed on the canva um, website or the app you can just search for the business card in order for you to create um, a business card and Canva is going to give you all the business cards that are available for you to select you just um, choose the one that works for your brand and you tweak it and make it your own so this is the these are all the available options and you know most if it shows free it's free if it shows that dollar sign it means that you need to be on the pro version of your Canva so I like this one and you just double click on it and Canva opens the Canva so that you can tweak it so all you need to do is to just start clicking and editing so the Canva software is a graphic design software for all of us who do not have thousands of hours spending and trying to figure out um, what to do on the softwares that are available so you would then start adding this is the page one of our digital business card and you just add it like that you highlight you change color to all of this to suit your brand so I'm going to click and drag it a little bit up here and the logo I want it here at the bottom of the page so you tweak it and you make it your own we are in YouTube agency and then you just tweak it and you make it bold so that it suits your needs so I would like to change this logo and use my own um, I have uploaded it before so I want to go find it there we go you just click and drag it so that it's on top of the logo if it doesn't want to do that that's fine you can just delete that one and add your logo so that is how you change the information um, on the digital business card so that it follows in line with your brand so these lines are kind of like so all you do you also just click and you just change to suit the color branding of your uh, line of business and that's how it gets done nice and easy and the last one we change so that it suits the way our brand is I love it it looks awesome then I go to page two I do exactly the same thing that I've done on page one I change the name to suit the person that I'm creating for in this instance it would be me and then you change it and you tweak it and you make it your your own so the address you would also make it your own and change it and then um, you do it like that what I want to show you is the email address as well as the website if you highlight it like this and you click on the ellipses you are able to link the email address or the website to your actual website that you own as a brand so you can just add your own um, website address I'm going to add ours design.co.za and then you just click apply the line to show on your business card and you want to take it off you just highlight it like that and you go to the ellipsis and you just click on the underline and then it goes away 
whenever your customer gets the um, business card and they click on there it will take them straight to the website because you've added the link there so because we've done editing the business card now we are ready to publish the business card and then we can get the website address that canva gives us so that we can create a qr code so we would then go to the ellipses and then we would scroll down and look for website or you could just search for website on there and you select website because we want to publish it in presentation mode so that we can get the website address what then happens uh, the canva tool creates a website and there's the card it shows and canva gives us a website address so once you've copied copied the address you will go back to your design and then you're gonna go to the design side of things and you're gonna go to these ellipses this side and you're going to click on the QR code and once you've clicked on the QR code you would enter either your own website if you want to redirect customers to your website or you could add this um, website that was created for us by Canva you would then generate a code so I want to generate it on page two uh, then Canva generates the code for us you could make it a little bit bigger my name take that back and you just put it here at the corner whenever somebody um, scans this code it will take them to where you've redirected them to whether it's your website or this digital uh, business card and that is how you create a digital business card so now you're done you're happy to um, download it you're going to download it as a PNG because you want to drop box it to your um, document so that you have it or email it to yourself. If you want print, I, I don't know why you would want print in 2021, but okay, who's judging? Um, you can do PDF. But for now, we're going to go with a PNG and two pages, which is download. And then the Canva would download the two digital business card and then we would email it to ourselves and once um, it gets emailed to ourselves we send it to our phone anytime a customer wants one we just send it via uh, Bluetooth or uh, WhatsApp when they scan this code then it takes them to where we saved it to and we've saved it directly to this card and that is how you create a digital business card on Canva. Thank you for joining me for this tutorial. If um, I'm adding value, uh, please don't hesitate to subscribe because it adds so much value to my channel and what we're trying to build for African entrepreneurs who are working on a budget. So if you have any comments, please on the comments, write your comments for me and tell me how are you dealing with um, sending digital business card are you using are you using digital business card or are you still using the old school card um, that we used to use in the past however thank you for joining me that's the end of the session i'll see you on the next lesson thank you